welcome back everyone for some more of my Newport County Road to Glory career mode for FIFA 19. And as you probably figured, this is about the time where I'm getting really close to clinching promotion to the championship. And before I get into this away game against Mansfield Town, I should show you the table here real quick as you can already see. I have 10 games left to go. I have a 30 point lead over third place Burnsley. I did hit the Centurion mark with 102 points with 33 wins and 3 draws. So, no matter what happens, if I win this game against Mansfield Town, I am officially promoted to the league championship. Which will be back to back promotions for Newport County. As you can see here at the bottom, it's Windentown look almost certain to go down back to League 2, while Doncaster, Wickham, Gillingham, and Shrewsbury look like they're going to be the ones fighting it out for, uh, in order to survive Doncaster ahead on goal difference. But take a look at what's going on since my last game against Brighton. Show off some of these results here. Three straight uh, clean sheets, well, four straight clean sheets. And then uh, in the quarterfinals, I got drawn against um, Sheffield Wednesday in the FA Cup. I ended up losing 2 nothings, but I'm not going to com complain or be sad about it. To reach the FA Cup quarterfinals as a League One side is a fantastic accomplishment. So, yes, this is a championship side that I'll be playing next season, but at the same time, though... With my pre-contract signings that I made this season, and hopefully I'll make some more signings next season depending on what my budget is, I should have a team that should compete in the championship. And some more results. Well, actually one more result before the Mansfield game. But, but yeah, without further ado, well, yeah. I want to make sure I have the right team out there. Veda Kaley actually came up to me and asked me if he wanted to start this game, which... Considering how fatigued Kaloris is, I was like, absolutely, so I'm going to give him the start as a striker. That dude from Mansfield Town is huge. But yeah, Veda Kelly made the starting 11 alongside Karunian because Mason Cooper is not 100% stamina in this game either. So, but uh, I do want to play Jay Baker in there, and I will put Cooper and Kaloris in there eventually. Mokoena is not real happy with me for the lack of game time he's been getting, so I'm keeping him in the starting 11, but... Without further ado, let's see if we can clinch promotion or league championship at Mansfield. You see Bushiri, my 77 rated left back? That's going to come in handy in a championship next season. See, Mansfield Town's not even anywhere near the top 10. As a matter of fact, they're, they're struggling in the bottom half of the table. can see the lineup. Not really a whole lot of names I recognize. They're pretty much the same team that they had last season when I played them in League 2. They're playing at the 5 or the back, which is interesting. And there's my starting 11. And we are underway here. Hopefully we can clinch promotion in the championship. Vedekele was wide awake on that one. Can he put himself on the board early? Yes, he can. Hey, he wanted game time. That's the best way to go about it. I wonder if Reagan Poole has a name on the back of his jersey in, for this game. Better Kaylee with another steal. Nobody's making a run. C can you get a rebound? Oh, we whiffed that. I think that's going to go out for a goal. No, that went out for a corner. Can you get ahead on that? No, he can't. Bushiri can't get a hold of that. Mokoena. Right now I'm doing everything right except get the ball in the back of the net. Oxford, Oxford Town is taking the lead over Bristol Rovers. I think he's offside. Yep. Marsh Brown did not time that right. Oh, I wanted to head it down, but that was kind of like an awkward header. Marsh Brown going down the right. Oh. Kind of a disjointed performance so far from Newport. I'm not sure how I feel about this. Okay, can you get it? Yes, he can. Ryan Haynes is right there. I don't know why he was in the box that, like that. 
that was kind of weird. And Poole does have the name of the back of his uniform. Poole. Mokoena. Enchiago. Oh, Enchiago, come on. Okay, can you get it? Oh, he, Vedicale made it. Can you go around? Can you go around? That was beautiful by Vedicale. That's his second of the game. Slowly getting into this game here. Can Enchiago force pressure? Yes, he can. Oh, I'm surprised I didn't go out. Vedicale, can he get a hat trick? No, he can't. Oh, he still has the ball. Mokoena, can you shoot? That's kind of a weak shot. And I ended up going wide anyway. He was complaining about game time before the game, and so far he's not really making a name for himself here, Mokoena. Which I am thinking about selling him next season. So if I do sell him, that's going to have to be one more body I'm going to have to put in the squad, because my squad is kind of thin right now. And I will say this right now, Mokoena will not be in my starting lineup next season in the championship. Him and Inchiago both are refusing to grow for me. And I am willing to listen to offers for both of them. And Vedicale gets his hat trick. Yeah, I've not been pleased with the lack of growth, which, that's a good ball in by Kroonian. Yeah, I've not been pleased with both Mokoena or Inchiago at all. They, they've only grown by two. And the two seasons that I've had them, I thought they'd be shooting up and overall. Especially by how, how much I've been playing the both of them. I've been playing them both almost every game, but yet Mokoena has the audacity to say he doesn't get game time. Yeah, I think there are days with Newport County are numbered, to be honest with you. Oh, that was a good attempt. Megan Poole, that was a good header. The Newport County captain. Getting it on a tough angle, which I kind of wish I wouldn't have X'd out of that. Tell you what, Kale is a beast in terms of getting the ball back, and that's his fourth of the game. He's going to be a big part of my squad next season. Yeah, I have no intentions whatsoever of selling Kale. If anything, I'm going to probably give him some training next season, see if I can get him above 70. I know his potential on South FIFA says that his potential, well, I'm being redundant there, saying that it can only reach as high as 69, but I think it can get higher than that. I think it, I can try to get him in to the uh, mid-70s. And once again, a good ball in by Kroonian to get Marsh Brown. Turning into a routine game here for Newport County. Better Kaylee once again. Oh, that was my fault there. Okay, better Kaylee. Oh, he's getting kind of fatigued, so I'm not gonna get too mad at him for that. Okay, Anya's just watches it go by, which is probably for the best. And Chiago, Mokoena, can you score? No, voice is a good save from the goalkeeper though. Decent attempt though. I do have to say that. Okay, oh, can you get ahead on that? Can you win that? Nope. And Chiago, can you shoot from distance? No, that would have been... Haynes, can you score? No, that's blocked. Oh, that hit the post. Good technique there by Ryan Haynes. He Kind of unlucky he didn't squeeze that inside the post. Okay, can you win that ball? Okay, better Kale. Yep. Scores another goal for me. And that's his fifth of the game, I believe. Yeah, he's probably going to be subbed at halftime. I'm going to put Caloris in there. And there we go. We are potentially 45 minutes away of securing our promotion to the league championship. And in essence, uh, one step closer to securing the league one title. 
So yeah, this, which I didn't say at the beginning of the video, this is probably going to be my penultimate episode of Season 2 of this career mode, and then the one after this will be the talkie bit at the end. Okay. I'm going to make a triple sub right now. Uh, I'm going to put Cooper in there. I'll put Caloris, and I'll put... And Chiago really has been invisible for me, so I'm going to put Baker in there. And I've actually been giving Baker through three drills in training. Hopefully he'll shoot up to a nice overall before the end of the season. Cooper passing it to Baker. Marsh Brown. Light cross. Oh, forces a good save. Yeah, I didn't want to cross that too hard because I saw um, Caloris making a run, whoever that was making that run. Okay, can you get ahead on that? Oh. Cooper tried his best to keep that in, but that was just too heavy of a ball for him. He'll learn to control that more as he grows as a player. I mean, this is his first season in the starting lineup. Yeah, I am going to be a bit more lenient towards, especially my younger players, because they are going to be prone to accidents. They're just going to be, that's just part of the process. They're, just, they're going to learn. Okay, Mokawena. Okay, it was, oh, Marsh Brown, what was that? You just had to kick the ball. Don't get fancy with it. I didn't want you to do bicycle kick, I just wanted you to do... And that was a bad ball. Can Caloris, can you score? Yes, he can. Okay, let's see. Now it's a bad ball by Mansfield Town. Can Caloris make a two? Yes, he can. Hey, my, give the ball freely like that. I'm going to take advantage of it. I should say, I did look, get a look at Newport County's kits for this upcoming season, and they look awesome. So that's... Their home kits are going to be all amber, and their away kits are going to be all black, but they look extremely sharp. Vance Town, I don't think they know what to do right now. Caloris again with the, the steal. Can he make it three goals? Yes, he can. Yeah, this is getting ugly right now. So that's three goals in a span of three in-game minutes. Oh. Okay, Mason Cooper, can you get ahead on that? Ooh, he actually, that was actually a good attempt, especially he had a defender up his rear end. Yeah, I'm not, I don't even know how he got that header, and that was impressive by Mason Cooper. Cooper, can you win that? No, you can't. Jay Baker, can you make something happen? Can anybody get the ball? <laughs> Thank you. Baker's already knackered, but that, oh, he hit the crossbar, how unlucky was that? But Reagan pulls right there, he gets the second of the game. Jay Baker, very unlucky not to have scored there. Yeah, J Jay Baker's actually gonna get a lot- Oh, come on, Caloris. Quit falling over like that. Jay Baker's actually gonna get a lot more uh, time because not only do I want him to grow based on drills, but I want him to grow naturally as well, so hopefully he'll shoot up to a decent overall. Melkowena gets a rare goal for me. Yeah, him and Inchiago, I'm gonna be looking for, or I'm gonna be looking at possibly moving outward and hopefully bringing some money. I'll tell you what, if I don't have at least two million dollar transfer budget next season, I'm gonna be fit to be tied. Okay, oh, Cooper, can you get it? Oh, nope. Is that gonna be a goal kick? Yeah, I should have just left that out. Okay, Marsh Brown, can you win that? Yes, you can. Can you get away from the defender? Yes, you can. Okay, nice goal by Caloris. That's his fourth of the game. 
Yeah, I'm not even going to collect that. There's no point. Yeah, a lot of my players are get, getting tired right now. I've had a lot of fixtures. Okay, Mason Cooper, can you make something happen? Can you make something happen? No, he can't because the defender was right there. Crap. I, I kind of forced it. Oh, what kind? Come on, guys. Mason Cooper, how's your long shooting? Once again, it hit the defender. Holy crap. Mason Cooper may not have got a goal, but he helped set up Kaloris there in a way. Yeah, I think Mansfield Town knows what, how dangerous Mason Cooper can be. And it, they decided to just make sure to get in front of every ball. Okay, can you get the ball back? Reagan Poole applying pressure, forcing Mansfield into a mistake, possibly. Could have at least tried to keep that in, guys. So they just put it out anyway. Okay. I'm going to pass it here. Do the safe option. Mason Cooper, make a run. Okay. Oh, he makes the save. He just cannot score in this game today. Yeah, Mason Cooper just cannot get a goal in this game. Okay, he's fatigued, but let's see if I can get at least a goal. Oh, he's pulled a hammy. Yeah, he's he's gonna go goalless in this game, and I feel bad for him because I think he deserves a goal. Come on, somebody get the ball. Be nice to get another goal. I'm gonna try to get another goal. Might not happen. Nice flick. Yeah, another goal is just not going to happen. It's just... Yeah. Kind of wish I would have got another goal, but it does not matter because Newport County has clinched back-to-back -back promotions. And look at them going. That's, look at my guy. <laughs> yes. Back-to-back <laughs> -back promotions for the Amber Army. Oh, what a beautiful sight. Back-to-back -back promotions. And this is the first time that Newport County is going to be in the second division of English football since 1947. They've only ever spent two two seasons in the English second division in the uh, football pyramid. Okay, let's see. Man of the match went to Ryan Haynes. Reagan Poole got the same rating. Let's see. You know, I'm, I think I'm actually going to give Man of the Match to the captain in this one, Reagan Poole. Yes, Ryan Haynes had a good game. He had a couple goals. But I felt that Reagan Poole was everywhere in this game. And I think he deserves Man of the Match more than Ryan Haynes. So, but yeah, Newport County are promoted to the championship. And one more victory should clinch the league title as well. I'm 30 points ahead of... Um, Rotherham, which I think I did clinch the title. Okay, they got one game. They they played one more game than me. They got 24 more points to play for. No, they didn't clinch the title yet. I, or should I say, I didn't clinch the title yet. But yeah, I'm not even gonna... What's going on? Wait a minute. Okay, better Kaylee's happy with me. And I'm actually going to do the training off camera and that. But yeah, this is the penultimate. Like I did last season. I'm not even going to show them left the trophy of the uh, league. I figured if I'm going to be showing anything, it'll be uh, something important like the FA Cup or something like that. But the next video will be the talk event. will be my season two finale of this Newport County career mode. So, But thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. I'll be seeing you guys again next time.